Hi, so I'm going to quickly walk you through sharing an application in my PPA. This app I made because I was talking to a buddy of mine today on IRC and he was saying he started to use cheese when he does a webcast to show himself from his webcam and that gives his video cast, you know, makes it seem more like he's talking to you. Um, in the meantime, I wanted to fix up Photobomb. There's a tab in Photobomb for using your webcam, and I implemented it with the Pi Game API. And I think GStreamer would be a better way to do it, so I wanted to prove my, to myself that I could do that by writing a simpler app. So here's, um, well, first I'll run the app, how about? So I'm going to use Quickly Run to run the app and try it out. And there it is. You can see it's really, really simple. All it does is put my webcam in a window, which is actually exactly what I want for this functionality. So I'll put him down there. You can see you can make it whatever size you want. And um, it seems to be working well. I told him to always be on top. So the way I wrote him was first I found the tutorial for GStreamer. It even has one specifically for the webcam viewer. After I Googled around a little bit, I settled on this right here for my um, my uh, string to get uh, GStreamer pipeline set up the way I wanted. And now, uh, and then I copied and pasted from the tutorial this functionality here that um, the dis displays the images coming from the webcam in, in your PyGDK window. So um, I think I'm going to wrap all this up into a quidget. It's, I don't see why anyone would want to do the um, rewrite this code again. And then that I'm going to take and put into a button. But in the meantime, I want to share this app with my other friends who do the um, webcast. So here's, I'm going to do that. I'm going to come here and I've already got my keys set up. I already got my PPA set up. So I should be able to just use quickly share. Oh, but I want to do some nicer packaging first. Let's do that first. So if you see here, I'm in the um, my app's desktop.ini file. So I can look here at the menu spec and see that there's a spec for video. There's a main category for video. I'm going to I'm going to use that. Let's see if we scroll down here. Doesn't seem to be anything secondary that is um, appropriate. So let's put him in a different category. We'll make his category video. I'll save that. Then of course I go to my setup.py file and my setup.py file. Um, <laughs> simple window for displaying webcam. Um, probably um, This is fine. Um, man, there's no URL yet, so I'll just leave him like that. I'll save him. And now um, I should be able to go and put him in my PPA. And the way that you put a Quickly app in your PPA, after you set up your PPA and your keys, you say Quickly Share. And now you'll see, oops, I actually, I actually have to go into the GStreamer webcam folder. So now that I'm in the directory, where he um, he lives now I can say quickly share and let's wait um, you'll see that the output's been cleaned up quite a bit the first thing that'll do is he'll go and connect to launchpad then he's gonna start exchanging my keys so he's doing a little work now um, Didier cleaned up these functions quite a bit so that there's less output but the output's easier to understand now if you want to see the output you still can you can pass the verbose switch to the quickly share command and you can see all the output that you want okay so um, it looks like I've already authorized the passphrase once for this key um, during this session so I don't have to sign it again I do just want to tell him to um, oh keep asking me before um, Okay, yeah, keep asking. Okay, so that just 
so when I clicked those buttons, it basically signed it for me, and now he's uploading my PPA. Now he's done up. Now he's done on my PPA, and he probably won't be there yet, but I can use that link to open my web browser, and then we should see. Um, see me my PPA. That's it. That's all there is to it. Quickly share.